I'm still good morning royalty squad your girl queen being a cup once again back with another video so it is about where my phone I think it's about like nine something in the morning it's about nine in the morning and I am actually in LA right now because I'm about to record some music with Armand and Trey and my husband Chris and also I'm here to do like collabs with certain people I ain't gonna tell y'all who I'm just away you know what I'm saying I'm gonna wait till y'all see the video but y'all gonna be happy about it um <clears throat> oh lord my voice I just woke up so ignore that but so um I always told y'all that I would do a makeup tutorial and this is really really highly requested by a lot of my subscribers the reason why I waited so long to do is because honestly y'all when I first made my channel I was like oh I'm gonna do a makeup channel da 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 but I wanted to show more of my personality and then plus on the other side I didn't feel like I was as good in makeup as you know I needed to be in order to be a beauty guru so I'm gonna change it up a little bit I don't want to just be a beauty guru channel like because honestly I'm not a professional I'm not skilled like a lot of other people but I can make myself slay you know what I'm saying it's, I'm just not like all the other makeup channels but today I'm gonna show y'all like just an everyday makeup look um that's like neutral that I'm gonna do on me and I'm not just gonna do concealer y'all this time this time I'm gonna do actual you know eyeliner mascara I mean wait not mascara but eyeshadow all that stuff so um I'm about to get started right now all right so the very first thing I want to do is put on primer and this is photo finish foundation wait hold on photo finish foundation primer you can barely see it. There we go. Photo finish foundation primer from Smashbox. And this is oil free. And um, a lot of people was telling me in my last makeup video that I did on a Chris and Queen channel that I needed to use like a primer or whatever. And I never really knew what a primer was for. But I guess it's just to moisturize your face um, before you do makeup and also um, help it to keep on your So. I'm just rubbing all of my cheeks, all of my forehead, get it moisturized. And um, honestly, that make my face feel real good. I'm just put a little bit more on because that felt good. I'm gonna go up here, so. All right, so the second thing that I'm gonna do is actually um, put on foundations. It's a MAC Studio Fix, and I have it in, um, what color is this? This is NC42. But y'all, this is my skin tone. And also, y'all, I'm so mad, man. Didn't I tell y'all that every time I get my eyebrows threaded, like, I get these little bumps right here. I don't know why it does that. I even put alcohol on it. But I'm so mad because, like, I really didn't think that it would happen this time, but it did. I'm going to actually put it on my hand first because, here we go. I'm going to put it, yeah. Okay, I need some more of this. Okay, I'm going to put it on my hand first, a good amount, like that. And then I'm going to go in with the um, NYX Liquid Illuminator so it can look a little bit more like glowy because I kind of want a dewy look today because I don't like I like it to be natural but I want it to be glowy too. So I'm going to just um, take my MAC brush. I don't even know MAC 170. I don't know what it's called. <laughs> but I'm going to just take that and then rub this um, together and then start um, putting it on my face. And that's definitely not gonna be enough so let me add some more okay now now that's better so yeah I'm just add some more I really need a mirror right here cuz I'm using this as a mirror which I shouldn't be did y'all see that doggone snake prank Chris did on me oh my god I hate that so bad I hate them bags in the morning I get on my eyes this nigga really pranked me and put a whole snake on me that was so bold you know what y'all hold on i think i'm gonna have to change spots okay this is more like it y'all because um the mirror is right in front of me and i want to be able to look in the mirror too yeah i'm still putting on my foot now the foot down foundation um and i'm just gonna take it and rub it all around my face i put on my nose too and my forehead but not as much on my forehead because my forehead don't really need it as much as like you know my cheeks because my forehead is like colored very nicely and some of my skin here is this color i am so mad about my freaking bones they are so ugly i'm gonna do my neck too and under here because i want my face to be looking all orange and my neck be looking yellow it just don't go it don't go boo now that i got that um 
honestly I realized that I probably should have started on my eyebrows first but it's all good it's all good this is my first makeup video so I will definitely do better the next time I don't want some of y'all talking about you know how I can't do stuff right because I'm definitely not a beauty guru I'm about to start on my eyebrows and what I'm gonna do is um first I'm gonna just comb them up or brush them up with the little spoolie thing and there we go now I'm gonna take my I just got this I just just got this and I really like it the Anastasia dip brow pomade and I'm gonna go in it's actually a brush that goes to it it's called I don't know it's just brush 12 I, I'm pretty sure y'all can see that but yeah I'm a, what I'm gonna do is um go in just lightly with it and then I'm going to go at my I'm gonna start right here a little bit and just try to do it lightly as I can now I'm gonna take this part of the brush and I'm man y'all can barely see that I'm gonna take this part of the brush and I'm gonna like go upward how my eyebrows grow like naturally alright y'all so I realized that I think I like my eyebrow to look a little bit thinner I don't know if I should go and redo this one or should I just leave it thick like that I think I'm gonna leave it thick and do this one a little bit thicker All right, so I decided I'm just leave my eyebrows like this, and then I'm gonna clean up the mess ups with the um, Anastasia. What is it? The Anastasia um, Beverly Hills. It's like a brow concealer. I'm gonna fin I'm gonna finish it up with that. But first, um, what I'm gonna do is well, no, I'm gonna do that now. I'm just go ahead and do that now. I'm gonna take the brush that I bought with this. This is um a concealer brush, and it's number 203 from Sephora and um I'm just do a little bit a little little bit and then I'm gonna clean it up on the side starting from the end Now I'm just taking my beauty blender and blend it in on the top a little bit so it don't look all white on the outsides. I'm just like blended. I really don't like my eyebrows right now, but I'm just keep doing it for the sake of the video. And this is honestly as real as it gets, this whole little makeup thing. I'm not trying to be like everybody else. I don't know. I don't know if I like these, but we're going to make it work today, okay? Because I don't feel like redoing these. Now, I'm going to um, take my NARS uh, Radiant Creamy Concealer. Oh, my God. And then um, it's called Custard, the color Custard. And I'm going to go under my eyes. I'm just dab it under my eyes. And um, this is going to be a little highlight, too, because it's real light. Once I blend it in and once I put on my contour, it's gonna be a lot like more highlighted or contour, whatever you call it. And I'm gonna also add a little bit up here on my um, eye area, my lid, because I want my lid to look a little bit lighter too to wake up my eyes. So now I, I really could use this to like you know um blend it out but i think i'd rather use my beauty blender and i'm gonna just dab 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 until you know it's blended fully
So yeah, boo, I'm blending this out right now. I don't want to look too white up in this area either. So I'm going to make sure I blend it good enough to where this all don't look orange and this look white. Because I still do want that highlight though. So I'm going to try to keep it a little bit lighter. Oh, and my nose ring is kind of like hurting, but that's cool. All right, now I'm going to um, dab it on my eyelids. Why do girls always do that face when they doing their makeup? They're like, I can't help it. I just, I don't know. It's, it just makes me get it better. Also, y'all, I'm going to put some, a little, just a little tiny bit on my chin area and down my nose. To give me a little highlight. I don't want my chin to be looking ashy now. I wish these stupid bumps went away. It's throwing off everything. I oh, don't know. I might not even get my eyebrows threaded no more for real. I know I said that last time, but now that I see that it keeps happening, I might probably have to do that junk myself. I'm going to take my Smashbox Contour Palette. I'm going to take this right here and I'm going to go contour up my cheekbones with it. And um, just keep going in like that. I want it straight when I don't want it to be like all messy. So I'm going to just keep going in to where it looks like a very defined contour but not too fake looking. Um, I'm going to do a little um, bronzer up here on my forehead area. This is the translucent powder. This is it. I know all y'all said I never, I didn't use it the last time on Jasmine. Um, but honestly, when I was using this before, I didn't like the way it looked. But um, I'm about to try again just to see how it looks. And I'm about to um, use my beauty blender to put it on here. And this is basically, I guess, supposed to set your contour to where it don't crease and stuff. Oh, that's a lot. <laughs> Put some on my chin, too. And right here on my forehead. Alright, y'all. So, while I got that bacon, I'm going to... Alright, um... Now while I'm doing that, I'm going to actually, I'm going to actually start on my eyes. So I already put concealer on my eyes, y'all. So I'm going to just put like a base on there that's neutral. And I'm going um, to use this MAC palette. I don't know what the palette's called, but I'm going to just use it. Um, and I'm going to go in with a neutral color like right here in the middle at the top. I'm gonna go in with this color which is a little bit darker on my lid to give it some more color so I just took a quick little break real quick I'm sorry y'all before I do more on this eye I want to dust off this translucent powder Alright y'all, yeah, since I dust that off, um, I'm going to continue with my eyes. Um, I'm going to speed it up a little bit though. I'm going to just, y'all just going to see what I'm doing with my eyes. So I'm going to start by going into the creases of my eye with a dark color from the, um, from the MAC palette I had. And then, um, yeah, I'm going to put some goldish stuff from the other MAC palette on my lid. And then I'm going to use a darker color on the outside just to help that, you know, pop a little bit more. Then I'm going to take the other MAC palette I have and use like a lighter color on the inner corners of my eye to wake me up a little bit. Blend it. I'm going to outline my lips really quick because they look real, I don't know, ashy.
So, um, I, I got my lips, um, how I want them. I don't want them to be too much, too dramatic. Now, I'm gonna just, what I'm gonna do is, um, go conceal on the outsides of here, um, real quick. Actually, I'm gonna do my liner first, then conceal it on the outside. Y'all, keep in mind, I'm really, really, really trying to do better on my wings. I can't do it perfect. That's what I'm working on, so don't beat me up over the head. So now since I worked so hard on these wings, which I still don't think they look good. That's why I just don't want to be a beauty guru. They don't look like how everybody else's look. But um, I'm going to go a little bit in more on my nose with the contour. And then after that, um, I'm going to um, use a little blush from NARS. Alright y'all, so now what I'm going to do is go in, uh, where's the blush brush? With the NARS blush that I had got, it's like a peachy, and I really, really, really like it. It's going to come, just so it don't look like two lines, like a contour and then glow, this is going to go in between my glow and my contour. And I like it, because it's really like rosy, but it's not too rosy. Y'all, I'm so ghetto. <laughs> I was like rosy, but not too rosy. I'm sorry, I'm just me. That can't be nobody else but me. I'm not like, oh my god, so I'm gonna go into the freaking I'm Nars. That's not how I do it. That's just how I talk, boo. Okay, so get used to it. All right, if you're gonna like this channel. All right, now I'm gonna take this champagne pop by Becca. Put it go all over my face just to wipe off any excess dust, dustiness on my face. <laughs> and I'm finished. I don't know if I look like I'm fresh out the casket or whatever, but this is how I do my makeup, y'all. Like I said, I'm not no beauty guru. Um, I want to you know be better and i'm about to go ahead and sleep these edges um even though they already laid wow yeah these already let um late but i'm gonna go ahead and sleep them a little bit oh want to be a model here that oh eggplant here that's oh egg here that's oh rat here that man i'm on such a big jambalaya juice pinto bean here that's up so i went ahead and i sleeped my edges y'all and as y'all can see this is my makeup for today kind of got a little rosiness in my eyes but um I hope that y'all like it. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Like I said, if y'all have any pointers, let me know because I don't feel like I did a really, really good job. But, um, I mean, I did enough to go out and look good. So, yeah, this is my makeup. This is my after makeup. Let me know if, you know, you guys want to see more stuff. And that's about it. I'm about to get dressed go out and i'm out i love you guys so much royalty squad make sure you comment like subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet and that's about it i'll see y'all later man hold on wait a minute no i did not close the video out and forget to do something y'all this is a dewy finish by nyx um setting spray and i'm about to just spray it on my face real quick to set it all right one two three let's go <sighs> this is a dewy finish y'all I'm just fanning. it. I'm so sorry. I forgot to do that. I'm retarded. So yeah, that's the last thing that I wanted to do with the setting spray um, to give it a nice moisturized look. And it looked better even already, y'all. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope I don't look like a drag queen. Gotta go again. Bye.
I'm still